Not all mortgage brokers are created equal. Yeah, hi, I'm Bill Turney. I'm with Michelle Leonard Real Estate here in Cohasset. And yes, not all mortgage brokers are created equal. Um, and I run into this and I have my vetted few uh, mortgage loan officers who are, are each uniquely good in certain skills. Some can do can cross over in other areas um, and some are better at certain things than others. But today I'll give you a quick story on what happened this week. Um, I got a call from a client who was very interested uh, in a property over in Hull. Um, and so we went out to take a look at the property. Um, it was There was a lot of interest in it, competitive situation. We put together uh, a competitive offer. We ended up winning the multiple offer situation, get through the home inspection, get through the purchase and sale agreement. And you know we're really down to waiting on the loan commitment. And the loan commitment doesn't come through because the mortgage broker pre-qualified the client for more than they could do. Um, and so, you know, the math was bad because you didn't have a great mortgage loan officer. This client, you know, does a lot of business at her local bank, went with a local bank person. I've got a local bank guy I like. He's very, very good, um, but not all of them are. And so the long and the short of it is, I had to pull a rabbit out of a hat with one of my, you know, um, current team members of, you know, mortgage lenders who was able to take the down payment that the client had and make it work with the home um, and, you know, kind of <clears throat> shuffle things around um, so that my client could get to the closing table. Um, so when, you know, your real estate professional recommends a loan officer, it's probably somebody who's experienced. And if you have a good real estate agent, they're going to actually match that loan officer with your needs because certain loan officers can do certain things better than others. Um, that's my two cents on how to choose the right mortgage broker. Sometimes you have to listen to your real estate agent because I've worked with lots of them. I've seen good ones and I saw bad ones like I've seen this week. Um, and that's how it works in real estate. Anyway, I appreciate you watching my video. If you have a second, give me uh, a subscribe, like, follow, share, um, whatever medium you're seeing this on. It has its little icon uh, for doing that and uh, I'd greatly appreciate it. Make it a good week and we'll catch you soon. Thanks.